welcome to Purcell Presents Colors Food Trail Season 4. Powered by Lifebuoy in association with Panadol, Pananatural, Centrum, Nair, Jif, Al Baker, Caperson, and Al Osra. Ramadan Kareem to everyone. I am Yachna. Today's episode is our guest, truly special. Because they have a talent that is very low. They have a capability to get a lot of Wow. Well, I really, really wish that at the end of this episode, she goes back smiling. Because our chef, Abs, is going to make sure that happens. Cuties, my name is Tanya. I'm from New Delhi in India and I've been living in Dubai for 12 years. I moved here for my first job fresh out of university to become a graphic designer. But life had other things in store for me. In the last three years, I've become everything from a content creator to a stand-up comedian. I sing, I play the piano, I talk into the screen. It's been great. And today I was invited for the Colors Food Trail episode in which they asked me what my favorite food is and I said it's free food. So join me on this journey and we'll see what they have in store for us. Well, we have our guest with us. Hi, Sanya. Welcome on the show. Thank you so much. Hi, how are you doing? Ramadan Kareem to you. Oh, Ramadan Kareem to you too. Your journey actually has been so interesting and Chef Abs and Hi. I are very Hi. excited to yes. hear your experiences. And then I'm excited to see how he interprets that and brings it to life. I'm True. really looking forward to it. I love food and I love free food. So, <laughs> okay. It's so going to be a really great day for me. <laughs> Team Sanya, we all yes. do. <laughs> yeah. Well, I absolutely love your look. Thank you so much. I love your look. You are so stunning. I swear to God. I like saw you and I was like, oh my goodness. Well, I have my jeans and my parents to thank for that, I think. But since you asked, few of my friends really swear by finishing touch flawless facial hair remover. Obviously, practices like proper hydration helps. But using Finishing Touch Flawless Facial Hair Remover removes unwanted hair above, below and between brows. It's dermatologist approved and hypoallergenic and safe on all skin tones. No nicks, cuts, bumps or irritation. It's painless and removes hair from the upper lip, chin, cheeks, neck and forehead as well. Flawless skin anytime, anywhere. I could use some of that. Where should I get this? Well, let's to your nearest stores. Okay, I'll definitely check it out. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I think I, sh I should also try it. <laughs> I've seen two ladies complimenting each other and you forgot this handsome chef. Oh, you look really great. Thank you. Well, I you have abs, Chef Abs. Chef Abs? Do you yes. have abs? <laughs> Trying. Okay, well done. So I would be really intrigued to know that how did your journey start? And I'm sure there's an interesting story behind it. So it has been quite an interesting journey, thank you for asking. I actually moved to Dubai 12 years ago and I was working in advertising as an art director. Mm -hmm. And you know, life was going pretty normally. I met someone, I got married, but then I got divorced. Mm -hmm. And that was a really difficult time for me. And to deal with that pain and that phase of my life, I started doing stand-up comedy. But you know, stand-up comedy also is such a profession that takes you around the globe. Mm -hmm. And you get a chance that you're going to different cities different cuisines, different food try. Kar rahe. Yeah. So that is why yeah. we would like to know your food journeys as well today so that we can create something special. My favourite city in the world, however, I went to for the first time in my life last year, I went to America, I went to New York City and I can't get over it. It's just the best city in the world. Oh, yeah? great. Is it stand-up comedy-wise or food-wise? Food wise. I mean, it's everything-wise. It's you a melting know? pot of many cultures. It's just, the food is amazing. I love the street carts. New York City is so different. You can go out and look anywhere. Something interesting is happening. All of the time, at any time of the night. You're so right. You're yeah, so right. Yeah. And yes, the cart business is serious. Even when it comes to Delhi though. Street food is just, it can't get better than that. I love street food. <laughs> Delhi, like, yeah. I think that's the reason I like such spicy food, especially like my mom and I, we mm. used to love having pani puri mm. in like Lajpat Nagar in South Extension in Delhi. Mm. And we also used to have this thing called kamrak, which is a star fruit. You know this? Fruit, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a yes. green Shaka color, Kandu. star yeah. shape. Yeah. yeah. And it's really spicy and khata. And mm. I just enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, with so you mom. love spicy food? I love spicy food. I love uh, Arabiata pasta. Okay. 
because that's like you know like penne rabbiata again with lots of chili lots of chili <laughs> lots of spice you know when i went to italy i would carry like a bottle of chili flakes with me and a bottle of tabasco oh. and the italian chefs would get very angry yes yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. the food is very uh, not spicy at all yeah. they don't even chili I at say, all yeah. i can't taste this so they I only have chili oils in <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah chili oil yeah. i was like this is sweet So <laughs> don't tell them I said that. Yeah. Delhi okay, are watching. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I love penne rabbiata. I actually I've been to Greece as well. I went to Santorini and I had this amazing dish called a bifteki, Ooh. and it's like this beef patty, and it's just it tastes like a rainy day in a garden. I I can't explain it. It's just really delicious. Shayari ho gaye yahan. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
So okay. here I'm adding all the spices, the whole spices, mm -hmm. uh, cinnamon, then uh, cardamom and some black pepper. Garam masala. The garam masala. I'm just going to fry it in the pan. I know my stuff. Okay. So now we're going to add some uh, chopped onions to this one. Yeah. Wow. Lamb chops. I marinated these lamb chops with some ginger and garlic. Okay. Okay. Usually use the lamb shank, but I'm using the chops. All right. You can smell it. So it nice. Let it cook. So simmer good. it for some time. Wow. Now we have time to go on the next dish. Oh. We'll go on the kebab. All right, lamb kebab. Mm. We're gonna take the lamb mince here. I'm just gonna add spices here. Spices here. Mm. Some black pepper. Some coriander powder. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mix it up. Chop parsley. Yeah. Okay, now we're adding some color. Now you can see it's nicely mashed. Yeah. Okay, like comes together. We'll keep this one here. Now I'm gonna make the kebab. So I'm gonna take the labne cheese. Labne? Yes. So what I'm trying to do here is that yeah. I'm going to take your uh, achari uh, kamrak memories mm -hmm. yeah. okay, and turn into a kebab. Okay, but I'm going to use the panchapuran, which is achari masala. So you have this mustard seeds. Okay. okay. Add that one. I'm going to add some coriander powder. Wow. Some cumin powder. Okay. I'm going to leave it here to marinate. Okay. okay. I'll take these kebabs. Time to cook our kebabs. Yes. I'm going to take this rosemary and thyme, some butter. Oh. Just brush it here. Oh. I think the grill is hot. Let me check. Yes. yes. <laughs> nice and smoky. It confirmed. Okay. Wow, we're at the final home stretch, huh? Yeah. Oh my god, that smells so good. I'm so excited to eat this. See, this is gonna take a little time. Yeah. But I'm gonna quickly want to ask, like looking at this fire. And a rapid fire here. Mm. A little faster. Who would you pick as your favorite? Performing right now in the current scene, Indian comedian. Vizas. Oh, easily. Easily. I yeah. Think. Which style do you find the most challenging when it comes to comedy? Um, I think actually talking about your real life experiences and yes. being vulnerable on stage, that's probably the most challenging because you're putting yourself out there and if they don't laugh, that's tough. So, so I think that's probably. I think from that, I'm just gonna lead to only one more question. Yeah. Any embarrassing, awkward stories? Well, there actually something happened when I was in New York in the green room. Okay. So the green room is where all the comedians sit yes. between their sets, yes. right? And I so I had never been to America before and I used to follow all my favorite American comedians. And there was one who was quite famous. And I perf was performing there that night and I went to the green room. And as soon as I entered, I saw him and I went, whoa. 
and then everyone stopped Me- talking and looked at me and I just stood there like I'm so sorry <laughs> and then and then I went and sat there huh. and I didn't know what to say because you don't know how you don't know I don't know how to come back from whoa oh. so I just sat there and stared at him but did you say anything no okay. and then finally he spoke to me after like 15 minutes of me just staring at him <laughs> so that was kind of awkward I think I think kebabs are also half done Ooh, yes oh look at that all right time for plating oh ho and we can see the plate is also truly special yes. oh it's so it's it's turkey so inspired. yeah this is yeah. this is turkey Istanbul. inspired in istanbul this is a this is jajik cream which is basically your cucumber yogurt some mint yeah and this one over here the kebabs on this one oh wow <laughs> that's This is the most exciting one that I'm most curious about. Wow. Beautiful plating. Okay. This plate is almost ready. Okay. I have a surprise for you. Okay. You tell me what is this? Baked beans. Eat it. It's not fish egg, right? No, it's not fish. Okay, eat it. Yeah, eat it. Full thing. Yes. In one go. Yes. Is it sweet, savory? You won't tell me. I won't tell you. Spicy. I'm guessing. I won't guessing. tell you. Mmm. What is that? It's made from chilies. Wow. It's really good. <laughs> you made chili pearls. Yes, I we made really chili pearls. I really like that. Why is it? Because she keep talking about chili, chili, and chili. So we're gonna have. It's got a really good kick. Uh huh. Mm. Oh, oh, chili oh, pearls wow. on your tapa, dude. Wow. Okay. Now this looks like the food that I don't oh, want to touch so because pretty. it looks so beautiful. That's so pretty. Wow. So with the kebabs and this kind of platter, I would love to eat with naan. Whoa. So now here we have Halli Rams tandoori garlic Ooh. naan. The solution. I mean, it's very simple to cook. It's pre-cooked. It has a garlic and butter. You wow. just put on the grill or tawa or just heat in the microwave. Simple. So that, ready to eat. That's yeah. so convenient in the microwave. Yes. So you don't yeah. have to know how to cook. I can just. You can just put. <laughs> that's great. Yeah. You know that's haldi ram. Barso se pyar jatane ka tarika. Are you ready? Because I'm absolutely ready to try this beauty. I'll just take it from here. Okay, so that's the kebab. And I what think your to- special chili pearls. We're so close. Okay, and that is the pearls. Okay. Yeah. You want to take a bite? Go for it. Okay. Mm. Has it done the magic? <laughs> so all the details have come together. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay. The chili. The pearls. Like that was perfect. Okay. Wow. Ooh. Okay. Right. Mm. Now second. Okay. You take one. I take one. Yep. Okay. Or do we just have Chef, in one go? Chef, would you like to try no. half? Oh. Mm. I would not have guessed. Mm. So it's sour, but it has that creamy texture. Yeah. But at the same time, there's also a hint of spices going. Perfect. Now the third one. Yes. Okay. Let's go. This is like inspired by the Nihari. You have to Yeah, Nihari. It's inspired by Nihari. Mhm. That it yeah, takes some onions. Yeah. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. I honestly want to eat the rest of it, but I feel like <laughs> Am I allowed to? I'll wait until the break. You can eat everything. It's for you only. I'm going to finish it. But yeah. we are not done. Yeah, I know that. And why, there yeah. is dessert. Dessert, yes. yes. But we but need some clues. What do you like? What kind of desserts are your favorite? So growing up, my sister used to. My sister's a great chef. Uh, she used to make bread pudding and apple pie at home, and okay. they they were so yummy. That those two were my favorite desserts. My sister Tamina. And um, 
I also really like kunafa, which I think I went to Turkey actually and I had kunafa there for the first time. Yes. So I like these three things are my favorite. Cool. Let's work out something on that one. I will create something dessert for you. Mm-hmm. And we'll okay. be back with that. So don't leave us yet because the challenge is still on. Welcome back to Purcell Presents Colors Food Trail Season 4 powered by Life Boy in association with Panadol, Panadol Natural, Centrum, Nair, Jif, Al Baker, Flawless and Haldirams. And now my favorite part of the show, the dessert. Are you excited? Because I'm just looking at those flowers and then there's a lot of light on the plating. So yeah. Uh, so tell let us. me let me explain this yes. one. Obviously a love for new york Ooh, yeah so yes. bringing that on a plate which mm. is a new york apple the mm. big apple the inside oh, yes so the big cute. apple yes. inside the the new york cheesecake filling oh inside that your apple pie is favorite oh, oh my god oh my god so okay. i give a little twist to that one i gave a little miso flavor to that one miso yes miso apple pie wow new york cheesecake cake coated with white chocolate Oh my goodness. And bread pudding you said you love mm, the bread pudding I so do. I've taken the bread pudding sauce. Wow. Oh. oh my god. And the lights because she said she loved the neon. Oh. Okay. All and she the said turquoise has been incorporated. So I rushed yes. to the market and got this for you. Thank you. <laughs> It's so beautiful. It is. So let me plate. Central Park, New York. So there are a lot of flowers there. There are. I love Central Park. <laughs> you know how in all the Hollywood movies that we've seen, yeah. like in some scene in New York, there will be like smoke clearing, and then you will see yeah. the love interest oh, coming wow. through. Wow. Yeah. <gasps> so your New York apple with the neon lights. and the smoke there it's like a dream <laughs> it looks like a dream Whoa. this trick of putting hot knife through oh wow the layers what is the apple stem made out of chocolate chocolate wow wow okay Oh. Right. What did you say was inside? Uh there's an um, mix cake? of uh, no miso uh, cheesecake with the apple miso pie flavor. miso flavor. Wow. Please try. Go okay. for it. I'm ready to try this. Let me try this. Let me remove some chocolate so you can have the sauce. Mhm. Mm-hmm. Try it. And flavor. some berry sauce, of course. Mhm. <laughs> I think that's the best thing I've ever tasted. <laughs> I think chef this is just magic you have that to have was... a bite. Come on. Oh my god. And that miso gives you a little sourness. Mm. Mm. That is mm. so it, it has good. That fermented, the tangy flavor. Mm-hmm. fermented flavor. Eat your masterpiece. Please. This it's is masterpiece. just amazing. Oh my god. How's the your butter pudding sauce? Oh my god, it's beautiful. I think the pudding sauce is a winner. Yeah, it's like the perfect mm. like a compliment. It's so good. All right. We done you for your dessert. That was so incredible. What an in, what an insane experience. Thank you to so much Thank for you. this. I mean, I've never ever had something like this happen to me. So I, this I really get surprised like in each episode, but I really have to say this one is a winner. It's just it's so amazing. It's so good. Yes. Like you should be You, you can see smile on my face. <laughs> just It's like going bigger and bigger and bigger. <laughs> yeah, you should be so proud of yourself. Thank you. Very Thank you. good. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. And a very happy Ramadan to you and Thank Ramadan you for Kareem. Thank Ramadan Kareem. Ramadan Kareem. I was just about to say that Ramadan indeed became yeah. extra great. Oh yeah. And we have something special for you. Courtesy Batiste. We have this hand for you. Oh my god, I do use this dry shampoo. Oh, oh okay. wow, what a coincidence. Thank you, Charcoal Technology. 
White teeth. Oh my goodness. It's going to be a great Ramadan for me. <laughs> <laughs> and indeed, I want to wish everyone Ramadan kare. Well, this was it for today's episode. Aap hume zaroor milega agle episode mein because there will be a new challenge. Yes. A new personality we'll get to know and there will be something new to try. Yeah. 